The folks over at IC Station have sent me a little module to test and show you guys. This one here is just an FM stereo receiver module. Pretty basic stuff, quite inexpensive, and a perfect little project for a beginner. Let's take a look at it. So today I have a little gadget from China. This is a, um, a little board that was sent to me from uh, the people at IC Station. And basically, this is an FM radio module. Now, who would find something like this useful? Well, if you, if you just need a, a, a line level FM radio, such as for music on hold or, or something, uh, this might just do the job because it's, it's very inexpensive. Runs off, I'm just putting the antenna on it, runs off of a single USB type power supply and just has a standard three and a half millimeter mini plug. So we'll plug that in. We'll plug it into the auxiliary out, or plug it into my amplifier, and we'll just plug this in and see how this little device works. Link to this is on the uh, the page. So say, really quite inexpensive. Hey, it lights up blue and it says hi, and there we go. It's just. It's just an FM radio, that's all it is. And you have a volume knob. I'm assuming that that's mute. And you just tune your frequency in. So this is, this is tuned into my little test transmitter. Target background. Tap to replace Pompeo at the CIA, Gina Haspel. Known for her time running so something the like CIA this. Torture. I mean, you could certainly put this into a. In the early 2000s, I guess I can just both she and Pompeo do that. Right. Turn the volume down this way. <coughs> something like this, you could plug into a pair of powered speakers, or plug it into an amplifier of any type, um, or say into a, if you have a music on hold for a phone, for example, or you just want to listen with earphones, you could just plug this in. It, it comes just as a bare board, nothing fancy to this. Pretty straightforward. It's just an FM radio, and uh, let's see what else it does here. So we have the frequency. Now this also you can push. I don't know what that does. I don't think it does anything actually. It goes from 87.0 to 108. And in 100 kilohertz steps. That's a weak station, that one. Just a basic. Not much to show you guys on this because. Not much to show you guys because. It's just a radio. You tune it in. It doesn't. I don't think, even think it's got any presets on this. We say it's got speaker outputs on here as well. I wonder if we can connect this to speakers. We'll try this because I've got the headphone output, but I have a feeling it's got amplifiers built on here too. So let's just see what happens if we connect this to a speaker. I'll turn this down to my royalty-free frequency of 80. What was it 87.5? And I've got my little test speakers kicking around here somewhere. Just got to find them. should point out that the USB input that I'm using, you can connect that to a USB sound card and it will output the audio through your sound card as well if you were to build this into like a computer case, for example. And it does have a 3 watt per channel amplifier to drive two speakers. And it also has a serial data input and output for controlling a thing over a serial uh, port. So it's uh, got a few features on here. I'm just going to hook it up to my speaker now and we'll just uh, see how it sounds. I'm just going to hook up one speaker, but obviously you can hook up two to it. And it would use a bridge tied load output, so they have to have independent leads. You can't share a common with them with these type of BTL uh, output chips. I guess that we answer that question.
It has. So there, it's not just an FM tuner, it's an FM radio that you can drive speakers directly. Cool. So a couple little speakers and this little module and a little box and then you've just built yourself an FM radio on the cheap. I will point out that uh, you can run it off a battery, you can run it off a lithium battery, three to five volts input so you can hardwire it directly, you can hardwire it to speakers. So a small lithium battery and a couple speakers and you've got yourself a portable FM receiver. This would be a perfect uh, kit for uh, an electronic beginner that's wanting to start uh, building kits and so forth. Everything on this is complete. Just solder a couple connections and you're good to go with a nice little FM radio. You can power a couple little speakers with it. Link to this is in the description and uh, we'll catch you in the next one real soon. Catch you later.